Good day everybody, I'm Michael Posnick with Century 21 Northumberland and today's video is going to be titled Yes You Can Buy a House in Prince Edward Island for Under $25,000. Now behind me, to my left, is actually not the house we're looking at. This house is uh, double or triple the price of the one we're going to be looking at today, which is a uh, CMHC house. In other words, somebody bought it, insured it, and walked away from it. Uh, if you're from the States, it'd be similar to Fannie Mae or, or Freddie Mac. So the house we're looking at today is 435 Drummond, and that's in Freetown. Drummond is known on the island as the best place to find Drummonds. As I drove in here on the paved road, note it's not a clay road, it's actually a pretty nice country location, we passed by a lot of Drummonds, so hence the name of the road. Potentially, with a good offer, we could have the security or alarm system included, which consists of a dog. The roof looks like it may have a few months left in it, however, it'll probably need some minor repairs. One of the things I like about these old houses is the beautiful wood details, specifically in the doors and the trim. This house also includes a uh, light sensor at the front entrance for your convenience. Here's a shot of the beautiful bay window, accentuated with pink trim. The roof covering may need some minor restoration. As an added bonus, this fabulous outbuilding with a fancy brass lock could also be negotiated as part of the deal. The house includes what looks to be a newer oil tank, vinyl siding, and some of the heritage windows and doors, as well as some newer light fixtures. Some of the unique features of this home is its genuine brick-like vinyl walls, washer and dryer on the main level, and historic or heritage vinyl flooring. This beautiful teardrop wooden door would also be included as one of the highlights of the home. We have a grand door surrounded with beautiful wood trim. Walls are a combination of wood, wood panel siding, which incidentally is extremely rare and hard to find these days, plus a combination of wood panel siding and blue wallpaper. The entranceway is highlighted by beautiful white windowed French doors. One of the interesting things about this room is from sitting here in the bay window, I can see a beautiful combination of original wood flooring vinyl flooring, uh, darker vinyl flooring in the kitchen, and then when I swing over to the main floor bathroom, which is also a huge asset, there's another type of vinyl flooring with a genuine wood toilet seat. It's these types of details that make these old homes really have a personality and stand out against the newer homes. Traversing from the beautiful original hardwood floor, we have a beautiful detailed hardwood staircase complete with just a touch of carpet to give it that hint of modern. Albeit the antiquated and old electrical system probably could use some updating, there's certainly a lot of positive things I have to say about the old screw-in fuse types. The master bedroom features an extremely rare vinyl flooring that cannot be purchased today, wood clad walls, a window overlooking the road, plus this working and functioning deluxe ceiling fan. It's obviously quite noticeable that some of the house has already been worked on and brought up to par, and there's other rooms that are left in their original state, held back by only your imagination. So that's it for Drummond Road Freetown, and yes, this beautiful gas range could be negotiated as a part of the deal. And I'll tell you something, in all seriousness, where else are you going to find a house for under 25 grand? May go for closer to 20. Who knows? A lot of these that do go on the market, people end up buying them, tearing them down, and utilizing the building lot. Where are you going to find a building lot in such a great location on a paved road just a few minutes from Summerside? Thanks again for watching. My name's Michael Posnick. Please make sure you join my mailing list at michaelshomes.com or michaelshomeshd. Follow me on Twitter. And most importantly, subscribe to me on YouTube for up-to-the-second updates. Thanks, and have a great day.